the doctors say what gave me what caused the stroke was most likely that Delta 8 stuff. I started using it because I didn't want to smoke weed. I just wanted to mellow out and I couldn't sleep. So I just used it, the vape a little bit before bed to get so I could, you know, it would help me sleep, mm -hmm. relax me and stuff. But I didn't know it was doing all this other. It caused a brain bleed, a bad one, obviously. So I know that shit's more popular now than it was when it happened to me, so. Just be careful if you're using it. I would recommend you stop using it because it started with headaches. I got headaches and I thought it would, you know, not from that, unrelated. But they say that's probably what caused it. So if it happened to me, it could happen to you. I just figured I'd share it because like I said, I know that shit is more popular now than what it was. But just know it's not, it's not safe and it can cause you to, sh to have a stroke or bleeding on the brain, which is a stroke. Or it can cause a stroke, so. Obviously, I don't do any of that now. I don't even smoke anymore. But I quit doing it all like one day too late, I guess. Because I haven't done anything since the day after having the stroke. But if this will help somebody, if you're doing it, quit doing it, or you, you might end up like me nine times out of 10. It's bad. Other than that, I was, I was healthy. I drink too much Mountain Dew, but I was healthy. I got a little gut, but I didn't have any like stroke stuff. My heart, they did tests on my heart. They did tests on my blood. They did a bunch of tests. Scanned in my head to figure out what caused it. They, they, and I told them about the other day and they said they got like a, a more than, it's become more common. Getting cases of stroke with Delta 8 as the culprit. So if you use it, I suggest you stop while you can. Or you might end up like me which ain't so bad, is it? Mm. But you should stop using Delta 8. I'll probably title this video something about Delta 8 God's a stroke. Something like that, because that's what it is. I just, I thought it was like a, a over-the-counter kind of medicine type thing that you could buy. But half of it's made in China. That, tells, that should tell you everything you need to know about Delta 8. It's made in a lab in China. They don't do it. What 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 is healthy amount? They do this much heals you, so we'll give you this much. Keep you alive. Just enough not to kill you. But yeah, it's 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 bad. And I only used it for like a month or two, and I didn't do it every day. It was like a month or two at the most. I used it. Like I said, I had headaches and I couldn't sleep. So I used it and it, it worked for what I was trying to do, but I didn't know all the other stuff was going on in the background until it finally blew up at night. That night it blew up, literally blew up my head. And so yeah, that's my warning to you guys. You don't have to listen. I just figured I'd put it out there. Try to help it. Maybe, maybe help someone if I can. But that's it. Alright. Looks like it's about to pour the rain down. Should we keep going or should we head home? Uh, I don't know. I only got one raincoat. And it's mine. If we go all the way out to the end of this road, it'll definitely be raining. Take us like an hour to get out there and down the main road and 
back, remember. Hmm. They could just go like around the mountain.